How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you a cool app called TaxCaster. It will actually let you predict um, what your income tax return is going to be just by inputting your W-2 information. Uh, if you haven't gone to a tax person or bought like a software yet, this is a great app. And I've been using it for the last couple of years actually. Um, again, just punch in your basic information, W-2, school information, and uh, it'll actually give you an estimate, a very close estimate of what you're going to get back on your income taxes. So let's go ahead and open it up. It's a free app. Go to the App Store and type in TaxCaster. This is what it looks like. It's powered by TurboTax. And um, so I'm going to actually punch in my information so you can kind of see how it works. I just got my W-2 today, so I am so excited because I'm ready to get paid. So uh, let me give you the breakdown. First, what you're going to do is going to go to your total. Oh, no. Excuse me. Sorry. First, you fill out these top questions right here. So your personal information. So if you're single or married, I'm single. Head of household. Yes. Hit your age. 24. Now you're going to hit total income. And then here, under your taxable wages, you would actually go to your W-2. And uh, you would want to look under, I think it's line line 1, which is wages, tips, or other compensation. So I'm going to throw in a ballpark, say 30000 And then your federal tax withholding. Uh, on mine, it is line 2. It might vary for yours, but uh, I'm going to put 4000 and then state withholdings. State withholdings are at the bottom. That's line number 16. That was about 28. And I don't think that was right. No, it's uh, line 17, excuse me. It wouldn't be a, th a number in the thousands. At least mine isn't. So 662. So now it gives you a general estimation. Right now it's showing 1934. And then just to show you a couple other things, you would hit your deductions, credits, and payments. And then right here, um, this is where you key in any extra information. So for example, it asks number of dependents. So if you have kids or if you have other people you claim on your taxes, that will affect it. So if I hit like three, watch how it jumps up. I get like an extra thousand. I don't have any though, unfortunately. So mine is at zero. Um... There's number of dependents under 16, full-time student dependent. If you hit one, then that affects you. You get a couple extra, you get like almost a thousand for that. Uh, children under 13 are receiving child care. And then you would put in how much for expenses. Then we go to education. Um, I'm in college, so um, I think I pay, I don't know, like 600 bucks or something, community college, whatever. And then that also will affect it as well. And then, um, are you the only child in your household going to a four-year university? Will somebody claim you as a dependent? So you just want to go through and ask the questions and hit on the different options. If you have a house, you can claim your interests, donations. Um, I do a lot of donating, so I put that there. If you have a retirement fund, you type in that information here. And then any other federal taxes you pay and other deductions, uh, medical expenses, um, alimony, uh, knock on wood, none of that. <laughs> and then employee business expenses. So after all that, you can go to final review, which is in the upper right corner. And then it'll, it'll let you kind of verify the information and make sure if you need to input any extra stuff. And right here, it shows the um, the refund. So this is showing about 3500 Again, this was a ballpark. So this isn't my exact. I don't think I'm getting that much. I sure wish I was, but it's all good. And then uh, there's also an option in the corner. There's a little eye for information so you can, like, share on Facebook. I don't think you'd want to share this information on Facebook. I'm not sure how that works, but that's an option on there. And what's cool, so let's say if I just finished and I, I'm seeing I'm going to get about 3500 back, which it uh, shows right here. If you hit learn more, it actually takes you to the TurboTax website. And now they have a, a, a free app you can download that lets you do your taxes on your iPad. Um, I'm not going to dig too deep into it because I haven't really, you know, tried it yet, but, uh, it's a free app and right here, I think there's a special price right now. It's only $29.99, um, to do your federal taxes on the iPad. So I'm going to do a separate video that will explain the, the actual TurboTax 
app and we can see how good it is and see if it's you know something um you know worth it to get but um this in a nutshell is tax caster if you want to find out hey how much money am i uh, going to give back kind of a ballpark this is the app to get so hope it was helpful leave me a comment let me know what you thought of the video and subscribe to my channel and have a good one